It sure was hot out there. And speaking of the heat, new at 11 tonight, that extreme heat killing a dog in Tampa and the owner arrested for leaving the animal out in the hot sun. ABC Action News reporter Julie Solomon uncovering tonight. It can take only minutes for dogs to suffer heat stroke. A Hillsborough County animal control officer responds to a home on East 8th Avenue in Tampa. He finds a wire kennel with a dog dead inside. Of course, we realized right away it was a heat issue because of the, the, where the dog was sitting, he was sitting in the sun. According to a report, two other dogs could be heard barking inside a utility closet. The room had a small window barely cracked open. The door was unlocked, so we were able to open the door, and those dogs were, they were barking like crazy while we were there, uh, and they were very anxious to leave. Animal control officers say it was 131 degrees inside the kennel where the dog died, 126 degrees inside the small room where they rescued the two dogs. 34-year-old Ronnell Ned facing several charges, including felony animal cruelty. Animal control officers say this should serve as a warning to other pet owners. Dogs can suffer heat stroke or heat exhaustion in minutes. Veterinarians at Pet Resource Center recommend pet owners even limit their dog's playtime between the hours of 11 a.m. and 4 p.m. at 6 o'clock in the evening. The sidewalk is nearly 120 degrees. I recommend people actually touching the pavement with their bare hand and holding their hand on the pavement to test to see if their dog's paw pads can tolerate it. Mallory Offner, chief vet at Pet Resource Center, examined the dog that died. The temperature of the body was extremely high. Um, it could, would not even read on the thermometer. Reporting in Tampa, Julie Salmon, ABC Action News.